When I'm with my shawty, we be thugging now. We in your city, we be what now? It's my last week back home, and I'm getting pretty sad. I've been back in my hometown for about three months now, and it's coming to an end. The longer I'm here, the harder it is to leave. But I know that it's gonna be for the best. I know that once I get back in Calgary, I'll be able to work my hardest with no distractions. And being there is what's going to get me to my goals the fastest and allow me to be able to provide for my family and give us the best life possible. I was actually supposed to leave just over a week ago, but change of plans, we didn't get the apartment on time. Da, 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 da. and I got to stay a bit longer which also meant that I got to see my friends because girl I was so last minute like I left it to 48 hours before I'm supposed to hop on my flight back to Calgary to meet up with 10 of my friends and say bye to them and I really thought it was gonna work and I was overly stressed it's a blessing in disguise that I got to stay longer and I got to say bye to my girls <laughs> decided to meet up with a long lost friend <laughs> we go way back and we literally met like when we were what like five yeah like three or four daycare daycare i'm emily <laughs> what do you do i'm a student i am studying holistic health mm -hmm. yes that's what i do <laughs> i'll put her details down below oh my because gosh. if you're interested in like your health and wellness and you know being healthy because i talk about that a lot on my channel and i suck at it so she knows how to get you in the right spot and she's tried to help me as well i just didn't take it <laughs> okay let me ask you three questions that you should know what do you mean you should know the answer to them okay what year did i switch to english school girl what grade three. Oh wow yeah You're is close. it three You're four four mm. second yeah <laughs> I remember we would always pick you up at the French school. Yes. We had like this whole little friend group. We were like tight. Daycares would hate us because we were always causing issues together. Yeah. If one <laughs> of us hated the color pink, we all hated the color we, pink. If we didn't like a snack, none of us would eat the snack. Like. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, we were troublemakers. Oh, no, I remember when Nadia, she didn't like pink. And then she was like, if any of you guys like pink, we're not friends. No, we were actually. So we all hated pink. We were the mean girls at daycare. No, I'm kidding. We made friends. No. Yeah. No. I think we were just our own friends. Yeah. One thing about my friends back home is that they are all about last minute plans, which some of y'all are probably like, okay, and like <clears throat> go out. No, I don't like going out, first of all. And second of all, I am my own boss. I work on my time. So I spend the entire day working and then, oh, I get 30 minutes to get ready, shower, and head out the door. Mm -hmm. Luckily, today I was actually productive and I actually got everything that I had to get done. So when my girl asked me if I wanted to go to the movies, I said, fuck yeah. So I just took a quick body shower and I put on this fit. Yep. Happily too. Got some black sweats, this oversized hoodie. Because it's currently 9.30 p.m. and I'm going to get out of there. It's going to be close to midnight. I'm trying to be comfortable. Plus, I live in Canada and it's winter and it's freezing. I be taking steaming hot showers though. So anytime I get out of the shower and I get dressed pretty quickly and put on a heavy fit like this, I start like overheating. Like I'm really hot right now. Anyways, I'm mixing two scents because I like to smell good. So I'm wearing this Twilight Sarah Jessica Parker perfume. And I just put it on the key points like behind my ears, my wrist. And then I put this Victoria's Secret's Amber Romance Shimmer fragrance all over my clothes type thing. Because like these body sprays, they don't be lasting long. You gotta spray hella. But I love the shimmer and it smells good. I actually think I may be a little bit too bummy this time around if I'm gonna be completely honest. So I think we're just gonna put on some leggings. But I'm trying to breathe. The only reason why I'm switching sweatpants is because these ones are like triple XL and there's like a stain on the crotch, which is kind of weird. <laughs> and if I run into anyone that I know, they're gonna be like, oh my god, I haven't seen you in so long. So I might as well wear decent clothes. I don't know. But now it looks so stupid. <sighs> this is why I stay home. <laughs>
rate the movie a eight out of ten. Seven. 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 It was cute Maybe though. Seven point five. Seven point five. Yeah. It was really cute. I almost teared up a couple of times. Really? Yeah. I'm emotional. Now we're back to today and today is my second last full day back home so we're going to leave town drive about an hour and a half out and go visit my family we might not be blood but those people are the reason why we are here so we're going to go see my father figures sister because my father figure passed away when I was five but we will be going to visit his gravesite as well and that's where Miss Aaliyah grew up my first five years of life we're in Rogersville so that's where we're going today I'm just going to call my aunt because we're a bit late there was some unexpected events that happened last night but we are gonna make it we're gonna be there hello c'est Alia on se réveille tard mais on va venir on va venir je pense qu'on va décoller peut-être environ un heure ou un heure et demie hello hello since it's my second last full day here I'm gonna do the rest of my laundry which is freaking a lot yes the drill because tomorrow I just want to focus on packing and doing my last minute self-care and you know the basics anyways here's my basic of OTD we got the new hair my hair is braided I have it in a half up half down I got this purse it is Kate Spade my mom thrifted it and gave it to me got this Nike sweater leggings and I'm gonna wear these black boots that my mom also thrifted and gave to me I love it it's so cute it has a little heel type feel a little taller and this cute little heart so cute well you should give them an OOTD and what what is that? O-O-T-D. It's a Outfit of the day. Everyone who has came over has complimented my mom's aloe vera. She's so healthy and thriving and she even let me cut off some pieces to put in my hair. My hair just ate it up like this. Qu'est-ce que je dis là? Comment je parle? You show your outfit and say where everything's from. Oh, where'd you get your shirt from? Thrift store. You know where I shop? Under Armour. Under Armour, okay. That's, that's right. And the leggings. Of course, same place. Thrift store and yes. the boots come show the boots of course same thing thrifted fit <laughs> just except for what except for anyways except for your body my bra your bra and panties yes gotcha wow made it to Rogersville and we drove past my childhood home and it looks so different. My father figure built the house. There was so many trees growing up and the yard was just so beautiful. It's still such a beautiful house. It's just weird seeing it like what? How many years? Since 2007. And then it's 2024. It's a huge difference. Mm -hmm. 